Hi, I'm Anthony Hughes, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to work with slurs in Dorico, the new music notation software from Steinberg. Creating a slur on existing music is very easy. Simply select a note and press this button, or use the key command S, and a slur to the next note will be created. For a longer slur, select where you want the slur to start and stop before you press S or click and drag using the mouse to make a selection. To create a slur while in note input, click the button or the key command S at the point you would like the slur to start, and the slur will extend as you type more notes, up until the point that you press the key command Shift S. Where slurs are used to describe both articulation or bowing and more wider musical phrasing, you simply create more slurs and Dorico will automatically nest them appropriately. You can create slurs between different voices on the same staff and even create cross-staff slurs. Dorico intelligently places slurs and automatically detects whether they should be drawn above or below the notes. However, if you need to change the default behavior, then it's easy to do so using the properties panel. Simply select the slur then switch on this direction property and choose the opposite direction. This is also how you create S-shaped slurs. The properties panel also contains other useful features such as being able to set the style of individual slurs, useful for editorial work or when setting multiple verses of lyrics. If this video has been helpful to you, please consider liking it by clicking on the thumbs up button and you can subscribe to our Dorico channel to see many more videos like this one. I'm Anthony Hughes. Thanks for watching.